All right, all right. LDBC, this is your boy Coach Sheldon Harrison. You're live, live, live on the Coach Sheldon Harrison Combat Sports Show Live. Whoa, Valentina Shevchenko, her flyweight de debut. And she comes in at an even 125 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a fight on our hands. But you know, I keep telling y'all that Pavel has a plan. And, 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 you know, every time I say that, you know, I sat back and, you know, people, you know, Coach, you, you, you just, you know, you love Valentina so much. Yes, I am. And I'm, and I'm going to like Valentina, whether you like it or not. I'm going to like Valentina because she's one of my favorite fighters. <laughs> Pavel has a plan. See, let me tell y'all the geniusness of Pavel Fedotov. The geniusness of this man is unmeasurable. This is probably the greatest mind in MMA right now in this era. The greatest mind. You know, Pavel knows the ground. Pavel knows submissions. Pavel knows. I bet you I could ask Pavel any question in the world, and Pavel probably could give you a legitimate answer. I mean, he could. Folks, that's just how, that's just the way that is. That's just the way that is. And everything this man touch, it just turns into winners. This man can't produce anything less than a winner. But Pavel has a plan. He's got a plan. And I bet you, you all, well, what is his plan? What is his plan? See, this was all an ingenious design by Pavel. Okay? See, his, his design was, you know, go up, to, go up to the Bantamweight division, get used to fighting those bigger girls, you know, being able to take power, and then come down to um, the 125-pound division and, and, and just dominate. I'm serious. I'm serious. I, 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 I guarantee you that was his plan. And then his plan is to win the 125-pound belt, and then after she wins the belt, go back up to Bantamweight. See, Pavel has a plan. <laughs> And, and, and I know some of you Valentina Shevchenko detractors. I, I, I know y'all don't like this. But it's the truth. I mean, Valentina's good. She's just good. I mean, these Bantamweights let this little old flyweight come up there and take them to the limit. This somebody, technically, they should have got them out of there. They big and stronger, got more power. They should have got Val out of there, but they couldn't. You can't stop the heart of a champion. You can't stop the heart of a champion. I mean, you just can't do it. And, you know, a setback as now Valentina's English is it, it, a little bit better. I'm looking at Valentina interviews all day. Her English is a little bit better. I mean, it just is. Her English is not too bad. I mean, you know, I can understand what she's saying now. And uh, it's crystal clear to me. I'm not going to stop until that belt is around my waist and whoever is in my way, I'm going to destroy them. That's what Valentina's saying to me now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. But being a Valentina fan, you know, it, it, it's just a good thing, you know? I mean, hey, look at this guy. Now I'm sitting back here, boy. And I'm talking about Valentina, and you gonna come in the lane where I'm at? How is this car behind me gonna explain this one? How are you gonna explain this one? I don't know who that guy is, but you know what? I, I need to follow this guy, and I need to go and, and, and have 911 come tell him, say, I'll make up something to say the man is speeding. How are you? He's beside me. How are you gonna explain this, sir? How are you gonna explain all of that? Huh. Well, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, Valentina, you know, I'm looking forward to her winning this title. You know, she's got a, she's got a tough competitor in front of her, though, and, and I know she's not overlooking Priscilla Cacciata. I know she's not doing that. She can't. Because if Valentina overlooks any one of these girls, that might be it, and that... No, I'm not ready to go yet. I'm not ready to go. I bet y'all thought, coach, coach, ready to go. No, I ain't ready to go. I mean, you know, and then, you know, my other question. 
what is Pavel's plan for Antonita? I'm getting impatient here. I'm getting impatient. Dang. I'm worried. When is Antonina Shevchenko making her UFC debut? She kind of teased us a little bit with that one interview. Y'all, you guys remember that? Oh, she teased us. She teased us, and we still know nothing. Antonina, how are you going to explain this? How is Antonina going to explain all of this, y'all? She can't tease us like this. I am an Antonina fan. And, 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 and you know, <laughs> me being the Shachinko fan that I am, you know, I, I, you know I, I, I can't take this being teased. Now, Antonina, you got to give us a time frame. You got to give us a time frame of when your UFC debut. And you know what? I'm ready to get the video game, Antonina. I wanted to get a, get the video game UFC 3, and I wanted to play as Antonina Shachinko. But Antonina, you ruined that for me, didn't you? You ruined that for me, Antonina, and that's just the way that is. Now, if they have a character creation tool, Antonina, I may have to make up a character. And try to get it to look as much like you as possible. I mean, come on, Antonina. How dare you do this to me and all your fans? I hope Antonina is in the UFC by the time they make UFC 4. I hope that she's in the UFC so I can have my dream of playing as Antonina Shevchenko. I mean, yeah, I'll be able to play as Valentina. I'll be able to play as Mari Raynaud. But I don't get to play as Antonina. Oh, well, that, that's just the way that is. Congrats to Valentina and Priscilla Cacciata for making weight. Now, tomorrow night's going to be a great fight. I'm done. What are you waiting on? Subscribe to the best women's MMA platform on YouTube, and there's not a darn thing that you can do about it. I'm done.